hello good afternoon good morning good evening my fellow creative designers and content creators welcome once again to another exciting episode on this channel and if this has been your first time coming across this channel please stick around subscribe to this channel like and share i have a lot of content on my channel and yes i have a lot of content on my channel as you are seeing what we does over here is photoshop graphic design that is exactly what we does here i have a lot of content in which you can learn from and if you are already a subscriber thank you very much for subscribing and being part of the family and if you haven't subscribed to please 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 subscribe to this channel like and share watch more and let me know how this channel has helped you in any other way if you are a beginner as well i have a photoshop course for them um, introduction to photoshop part one and two in which you can start learning and practicing and then start by designing some of the um, um core card uh, 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 yes core card or invitation card and other things and then send it to me on my dm and let's interact i have a whatsapp platform i'll post the link under the description for you to join and let's interact so this is what you are going to design today and then eventually we are going to do it in this way yes so we are going to do it in this first one and then eventually do it this way this is the mock-up of it in which if you look at it it looks very very awesome so without wasting my time all the resources that i use for this flyer i'll share them for you to design something and then send it to me on my whatsapp platform and let's talk about it so without wasting much time control and to open a new document yeah control and to open a new document and then we are choosing a5 if your a5 is not here go to print and then you choose a5 a5 or are you a5 is here yes choose a5 and then call it spiritual tribunal it's a check flyer flyer yeah so check flyer spiritual tribunal tribunal god so everything is okay it's going to be for social media handles and if you are going to print it then convert here to rgb color if you are going to print it but it's for social media handles so let's turn it to rgb and then the background is white and then click on create boom so you have this nice with me and then the first thing we are going to do is go to view go to guide and then set new guy layout and then set here to six by six and you are good to go so now let's work with the background i've already told you in most of my previous tutorial that graphic design based in four areas one first one is working with the background two working with the image if it's required third one is what um the introduction of or, or working with fonts or typeface or text and then the fifth fourth one is what adding beauty to the design so the first thing we are going to do is work with the background okay so we are going to import the first background which is this drag it into photoshop and then release it nicely like this and then wait for it to load guys always wait for it to load all right so it's now downloading but let's hold shift and then hold here push it to this side hold here push it to this side boom just to fit that side just to fit that side and press enter to check it like that press enter to check it. and now i think this is awesome but we are going to this side and go to color balance color balance and boom clip it like this and then get to this side press let's put 76 over there and then let's put here minus 74 over here and then put here 10 boom and now you see the colors are popping the colors are popping the colors are popping so the next background again we are going to drag this into photoshop nicely and then push it up like this push it up like this press enter and then let's go to the blending options and set it to this set it to this no i think we set it to this overlay yes overlay is awesome overlay is awesome and then the last background we are going to work is drag this into photoshop and then push it down push it down push it down like this press enter and then go to the blending option again 
and then we set it to something like this is awesome overlay again sorry overlay again and then add layer marks to that one because you are seeing some hard parts but click on b uh, on brush tool and then we do the size of the brush uh, guys you know how we do it already and i think this the background is here so put everything in a group Control j Control j good and then call it the background good so background is set nicely now the reason why we brought the guide is that we are not going to make sure that everything doesn't exceed this side and this side it doesn't exceed this side and this side everything will fall in between this and that yes everything is going to fall within there so the next thing is, is that we are going to work with maybe text and other details so drag this drag sorry So you drag this, drag this, and then release it nicely like this, and push it up. Always push it up like this. The press Enter, Control A to select it. Center it like that. Awesome, Control G, and then put this and this in a group and call it logo. That is the church logo. Awesome. So the logo is set, and let's set. Let's start doing text let's start introducing text let's start introducing text so double click this ctrl c to copy it t on the keyboard and then hit here boom and then ctrl v to paste it good and then ctrl t again to select it scale it up nicely like this scale it up nicely like this and we are going to choose a font for it we are going to choose a font for it the font we are going to choose is this if you don't have it please i'll leave a link for you to download them let's scale it up again drag it like this nicely let it push it at the center push it at the center let's scale it up let's scale it up let's scale it up and then and i think it's awesome press enter and then double click it or hold out and then drag it down like this awesome and come and copy the next test ctrl c to copy it double click this side ctrl v to paste it and then push it down using the arrow key and you see that side is not it doesn't fit inside so just scale it up like this and then push it this way awesome 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 so we are going to pick this side and then go here select here and then come and pick something like this which is awesome and yeah 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 just pick the same size and then that is awesome that is awesome for now that is awesome for now we are going to pick this drag this here and then push it at this side reduce the size guys reduce the size reduce the size reduce the size and then check blending option blending option Blending option, which one of fit, 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 which one of fit. Let's test them, let's test them, guys. Always test them, and I'm sure you will get one that will fit what you want. I think this is awesome. This is awesome. This is awesome. Let's reduce the size. This is awesome. Let's reduce the size and then bring it here nicely. Duplicate it and then bring somewhere here duplicate it and then you can bring it here just to make sure that some snow fill are inside let's test another blending option again and i think this is all okay this is okay so this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome okay so we change the text we change the color of the text yes we change it and then we pick something closer to red but not too deep red like that yes not too deep uh, not too pure it's a darkish red color like that and let's change this one to the same thing so if you look at the hex code 710000 good that is it 710000 then and i think this is done for the meantime this is done for the meantime then we are going to draw a beautiful rectangle here like this a beautiful rectangle here like this and guys let's pick 
the hex code for it and i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome and we are going to put the name on it the name is apostle Oko ajiman apostle control c t on the keyboard hit here control v to paste it and then we are going to change the font to sensor decorative font sensor decorative and yeah sensor decorative font we are not going to choose the black but rather we are going to choose something like a bold yeah i'm going to choose a bold font sensor decorative font and then be on the keyboard and let's push it on top i think we should change the color of the good 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 or oh, this no 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 so i think this is awesome this awesome this awesome and let's change this side or oh, let's reduce the size to something like nine or eight let's center and align let's center and align let's center and align so this select this side the center and align it good control d to deselect it and go guys guys we are on it we are on it we are on it we are on course we are on course we are on course then let's bring all oh, okay let's put this and all this in a group control g and call it theme good so the theme and then let's introduce the image so drag the image into photoshop and then check it like this and then the image contains a background guys this is one of the renowned men of god in ghana and if you don't know him kindly check him out on youtube kindly check him out on youtube his name is apostle okon ajima so you have to right type and then go to this properties panels click here to re remove the background just within a second all right so photoshop has removed the background it's quite awesome without wasting too much time in anything just within a few seconds and photoshop is done with the job so control t to select it and then reduce the size a bit and then push it down something like this push it down something like this and i think i still need to reduce the size and i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome guys if you look at the man in fact he is indeed a great man of god check him up he do what he does is a pure teaching pure word of god a pure without nothing no no nothing nothing like this kind of uh, i don't want to be mentioning but you know you know you know already you know already let's drag this side to enter a bit good 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 then the name we should increase it to something like um s and push it like this we just want everything to be in order in order in order in order and let's see if we can pick some color from his dress yeah 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 you can get some colors from his dress and see yeah yeah this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome good so the next thing we are going to introduce is the date time and details date time and details so let's put this one in the group control g and call it image or man of god man of oh sorry not men of god man of god yes apostle of Ajiman. guys check him out check him out so draw a beautiful rectangle here like this and then we are going to put the date and the time and other details on it and we are going to change the color to this side we are going to change the color to this side this side this side awesome 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 let's go and copy the date Control c to copy it t on the keyboard and then hit here Control v to paste it and then Control t again uh sorry 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 Control t again and then push it up like this awesome 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 let's opens up the side opens up opens up opens up opens up opens up and increase the font size to something like 20 will be okay 20 will be okay and then still opens up here opens up here and this is awesome this is awesome let's push this at the center double click this side and then let's change the color of this let's change the color of this 
to something like this, this, and this is awesome, this is awesome, this is awesome, this is awesome. So the date and time is set nicely. And then the next thing is which one, which one, which one, which one left? So this and this in a group, control G and call it date. Good. And then I left it, okay, the date and time all is combined. So date and time. All right, so all this becomes your date and time. And then the next thing you are going to do is maybe a location and other few information that might be needed. Okay, so we are going to draw another rectangle draw it nicely like this just draw it nicely like this and then let's change the color to something like this and this is awesome 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 and then we are going to put the location on it so the location is awoshi anya markets ctrl c to copy gt on the keyboard hit here ctrl v to paste it and then Let's change this size to Montserrat and I think Montserrat will be good. Montserrat, let's use semi boot and close here to something like, uh, I think it's okay. Let's increase it to 10 and then go to this paragraph and set it to this side and then push it on top. Push it on top, push it on top, push it on both. Con this and that, let's center and align. Control D to deselect it. And this is awesome, this is awesome, this is awesome, this is awesome. Let's add a location icon, drag it, and then reduce the size. Reduce the size to be very, very small. Control H to hide the guys, and then bring it here. Bring it here like this this should move a bit and then zoom it up zoom it up zoom it up so that you can reduce the size of the location icon this zoom it out and reduce the size to be very very small very 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 small double click this side and then go to double click it and then go to color overlay and then the color is set already so we pick the colors from this side yes guys you see and this color is also from the dress control zero to bring it back to normal so this and this select them control j and then call it location all right so location is also set nicely and then we are going to pick this image let's add layer marks and then be on the keyboard and then clear this part some parts like this it's awesome it's awesome it's awesome it's awesome then let's see if we can put some things down date and time should come down a bit then the man of god i think man of god should come down a bit and then let's see the team should also come down a bit the team should come down a bit and this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this awesome this awesome this awesome let's push the man of god down a bit because it's covering most of the information and i think this is awesome so guys if you have something like this now we are done but you are not done yet we are done but we are not done yet there are certain things we need to add so guys we are going to add some glues we are going to add some glues yes let's add some glues to it and make it look realistic yeah so drag the glue and then wait for it to load just have patience please subscribe to this channel like and share comment and let me know how you see this tutorial it's one of the tutorials i've done and it's always great i'm determined to provide you with great designs subscribe to this channel subscribe to this channel subscribe to this channel and let's grow together so push it somewhere here press enter and then go to the blending options and set it to let's test them let's test them let's test them let's test them definitely we'll get one that is okay so i think this is awesome so duplicate it and push it here and i think this is not okay so let's see the blending 
good ah this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome duplicate it and push it here duplicate it and push it here duplicate it and push one here duplicate it and push one here duplicate it and push some here duplicate it and maybe you can put one at the center and guys duplicate it and push one to this side and this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome once you are done we are not still done yet again so drag this and then push it on top and then rotate it this way and come and just right here 90 so in so doing you turn everything hold shape uh, sorry hold out and then scale it up like this scale it up to cover the entire screen then go to the blending option and set it to the any blending option that you think is okay for you and i think this is awesome or oh, but let's test more let's test more let's test more but let's test more let's test more and see let's test more and see if you don't get anything then you come and pick the previous one yeah i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome so just enter it and guys this is how i was able to achieve this awesome church flyer i call it spiritual tribunal presented by apostle oko ajima design and artwork by Opi graphics guys i'll post the link to all the resources that i use and then including the free psd file for you to download practice it and then have a fair idea on how to create a church flyer from your own imagination i love you i'll see you in the next tutorials bye for now peace shalom